Hey, what's going on, Cancer? I am your dope astrologer and tarot reader. This is your full moon in Cancer prediction slash reading. So thank you so much for hanging out with me. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, let's just get right into it. So we have a full moon going on right now. And it is in the part of the sky known as Cancer. So this is your full moon. Cancer, you are ruled by the moon. Okay, so you could be feeling very extra emotional right now. Extra passionate. Extra motivated. Because this energy is in your first house. So you're being influenced by the moon. You're also being influenced by Mars energy. So if you're not really fulfilled about you yourself um the way you look even your personality you may have the motivation to physically change something about yourself to physically go after whatever it is that will give you fulfillment right now some of you could be rethinking or strategizing about your career we are in murphy retrograde issues at work could be coming up and you're trying to like strategize how to like get out of it or how to like come out on top in a certain situation at work some of you just want to like strategize because you want more you want a promotion you want more responsibility you want the title or you just want career growth you want to be more successful and so some of you could um, start networking more, getting out, building your brand, you know, even if you don't have your own business, building your brand at work, becoming more visible. Um, and so because of that, this full moon energy, like I said, is in your first house and the first house deals with you, yourself, your ego, how you physically look. Some of you may want to present yourself a certain way. Some of you want to create a new brand, a new personality. Um, it could also include, you know, changing your physical body. Maybe you want to work out more. Maybe, you know, you want to start getting facials, change your hair in some kind of way, change the way you visually look. Some of you, I feel like you want people to take you a little bit more seriously. So you want a more polished professional look, or you want to be a little bit more trendy. You know, if that, if that doesn't resonate, then this is to me meaning that you want to do a little bit of more self care. You know, you want to nurture yourself more. You want to love on yourself more. Um, be careful about. I feel like some of you could be in this head space of feeling some kind of way that the way you thought something was going to turn out, it didn't turn out that way. Do not try to manipulate a situation into your favor right now. We are dealing with a lot with Mercury retrograde. It may not. You may be seen as someone who's trying to manipulate or trying to get your way. Um, especially if you if you've been trying to be slick about something. You know, you could come across of like your cover is blown. People see what you're trying to do. People see what you're trying to pull. Like, you know, if you did something and it didn't turn out the way you thought it would take that L and chill out. Um, what else? I just feel like, you know, you could be prone to lashing out if you feel like you didn't get your way and you should have gotten your way. This should have turned out the way you saw, you know, you visualize it turning out. And if it doesn't turn out that way, again, we're dealing with a retrograde season. So you may just need to relax and chill out. You trying to like, 
confront someone or you know pull somebody's card right now it may not be the best thing to do because with you being so emotionally driven right now you may not get the results that you want especially at work especially at your place of business especially you know if you have your own business this ain't the time to do that okay so let's see what's going on as far as your tarot cancer i hope you are well i hope you are safe overall energy knight of swords gemini aquarius libra energy <laughs> this is talkative energy this is bringing someone the scoop, bringing someone information, bringing someone news, or someone doing this to you, bringing you some tea, bringing you some news. The military could be significant right now, or your um, if you have your own business, that could be significant. This is like a time of like honest and direct communication, however, be careful like I said before you could be very emotional it may be easy for you to get triggered so watch how you say whatever this is okay so let's see what's going on with you currently thank you for clicking that subscribe button and the notification bell Currently, we have the Page of Swords in reverse. We have the Devil, Capricorn energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, toxic energy, ego driven. Didn't I just say that? Do not allow this energy to like make you lash out or try to manipulate a situation you could be equal easily triggered easily triggered to anger your ego for some of you i feel like if you don't get something or you know if something didn't go your way it could be like an ego blow and you may try to lash out you may try to manipulate a situation you may try to do some underhanded stuff and or someone may try to do this to you which could cause you to get upset some of you could, um, you've suffered, some of you could have suffered some type of loss, even if the loss deals with time. And that could have rubbed you the wrong way. It could have made you mad. Some of you feel humiliated. This is re revenge, revenge type energy. And this is Capricorn season. No, uh -uh. don't do it, Cancer. Some of you want to like confront someone because you feel like they did you wrong. You feel like they humiliated you. You feel like someone was not being honest, was not being a friend. You feel like someone um, brought drama to your door. You could be misinterpreting a lot. Like I said, Mercury retrograde, it could have people in their feelings right now. This is not good for you to like, you know, act on emotion right now. Some of you need to accept a loss and move on. And some of you need to care more about ending conflict than creating it. Even if someone brings some drama to you, you should focus on ending the drama or just ignoring it. I feel like this is energy that's coming to you. Some of you, this could be like your current energy or like something that happened in the recent past. I feel like some of you, this is yet to happen. Yeah, five of wands in reverse. 
spirit is telling you in the conflict don't don't take the bait don't try to you know reach an understanding reach an agreement especially if this is business related um some of you you've been applying for positions and sometimes it's not about necessarily getting the job it's about how you act when you don't get the position do you get an attitude do you you know do things to let people know you don't like the fact that you got passed over for another promotion you if that is so use that as an opportunity to show people that you are emotionally mature enough to handle rejection you know, when you get that rejection letter, you know, oh, you know, thank you so much for your time. I really enjoy interviewing with you. Um, I would like to, you know, uh, reach out to you in the future or reach out to me in the future with um, opportunities in the future. Let's keep the lines of communication open. You know, stuff like that, like you got to play chess, not checkers. And some of you, you're letting your or you are being warned not to let your emotions get the best of you in a situation, even though you may deserve something. It's all about how you react. Again, the moon, we're dealing with full moon energy. Moon energy is how you react and respond to the world around you. You don't want to be um, looked at as the one that's, you know, causing drama, that's throwing a temper tantrum, that pops off when something doesn't go right or something doesn't go your way. And you also, if you're not doing that, you don't want to be looked at as the person that, you know, engages in a fight, engages in some type of conflict. And I feel Someone or something is going to try and trigger you and get you out of character. Do not take the bait. Let me write that down. Do not take the bait. Don't let this person or these people get you mad and then you know once the new year is here and the mercury retrograde energy is over you're sitting somewhere having a lot of regrets about how you acted and what you said don't do that mm -mm. what's coming towards you Stability is coming towards you. More logic is coming towards you. Um, Aries energy here with the Emperor. Seven of Swords in reverse. The truth is coming out. So again, you don't have to react. You don't have to respond. Someone's truth is coming out. Someone's cover is being blown. Someone um, may have been plotting against you or like trying to trigger you and you will see it queen of pentacles in reverse more capricorn energy capricorn is your opposite energy and i feel like this is telling you cancer to take on more capricorn energy be less emotional be strategic be um, purposeful in your actions. Plan your steps. Strategize. Play chess, not checkers. Some of you, if you're in a relationship, you could be um, confronted by somebody that feel like they got some tea on the person that you've been seeing or that you're in a relationship with. Again, you're being urged not to act a fool. Someone could be trying to manipulate you.
someone could be trying to manipulate you into staying into a, a relationship or a situation that is not bearing any fruit. Clarifying that we have the King of Pentacles in reverse. So again, this is more fake energy. Someone you're, you, you will see someone for who they really are. You do not want to get in the mud with this person again, especially if this is a situation at work. <laughs> you don't want to lose or ruin your reputation. Temperance in reverse, Sagittarius energy, Taurus energy with the King of Pentacles. You may be mad because somebody doesn't have the money they said they did and it's coming out. Somebody may not have as much money as you or more prestige as you, you know, clout as you. Maybe someone said that they could help you in your career or help you, you know, double your money or invest your money and you're realizing that they can't they don't have the credentials they don't have the knowledge the know-how they don't have the money like they're not on your level you're the emperor some of you if you haven't heard from your father you could be hearing from your father it could be related to some type of money issue. Temperance in reverse, Sagittarius energy, nine of wands in reverse, more Sagittarius energy. You're feeling imbalanced because someone is trying to get you mad, trying to make you act out of character. Didn't I just say that? Don't do anything reckless. Reckless energy is coming to you or energy that will make you reckless. Be more like a Capricorn. And some of you, especially cancer women, some of you think that you're not being emotional, but you are when you react and respond in some certain situations, you are. And it's by your actions. Some of you, you have to do something. You have to respond. You have to like do something to show someone that you have the upper hand or to show someone that you're not being bothered when actually you are bothered because if you wouldn't bother, you wouldn't have to do anything. You wouldn't be bothered. You wouldn't care. Ouch. Don't take the bait, cancer. You got more important things to do. Some of you are trying to build your own business. You don't have time for someone to come in and distract you. I know you were thinking this person was going to help you. Maybe this person was going to sow some money into you, give you some money. Um, it doesn't look like they have the money to give. And if you don't know that, you will. This is um, also someone who could, who could be a scammer. A con artist. You know, just someone that they, they talk a good game. They can't back it up. I don't see any love cards for you. Um, I feel this full moon because you are, like I said, ruled by the moon. You're being shown things that are being hidden from you, Cancer. It could be a love situation, but I, I feel like this is about your business, your job, your reputation, your money. What's the outcome? The Hierophant in reverse, more Taurus energy. You caught somebody. You're catching someone in the act with a Hierophant. And you're catching someone because you didn't let someone bother you. You're about to go into a period, Cancer, where a lot of eyes are going to be on you with the Six of Wands. You could get um, some social media clout. You could just get a lot of attention. Some of you, like I said, the Six of Wands is Leo energy. So, you know, some of you, you're on your way. You're, you're trying to glow up and people see that you're progressing. People see the change in you. 
or you just have a lot of eyes on you. People are really paying attention to you. And I feel for the most part, a lot of you, this is regarding work or whatever it is that you do for a living. You can have people that are waiting for you to mess up, waiting for you to fall. The Hierophant in reverse talks about not gaining or using the wisdom and knowledge that you've gained in previous situations like you're falling for the same thing over and over again you keep falling into the same trap but if you do not react and respond this person will reveal themselves the true nature of this person will come out you'll catch this person Again, some of you, if your partner, if you feel like your partner is cheating or if there's something funny going on in that relationship, you don't have to say nothing. You don't have to confront anyone. It will come out. The moon is revealing truths to you. It's revealing what is hidden in your life. King of Wands. You're going to have freedom. Um, this is a, a lot of motivation coming towards your way as well. This is with the Six of Wands and the King of Wands. You'll have the opportunity to be on top. You'll have the opportunity to like slide in while these people over here are arguing and drama and all of that. You can go and make some money. You can go and take their clients and sell them. You can you can um, have like a promotion on social media while this person over here is in some drama. Stay about your bag. Stay, stay, stay grounded. Stay focused. Don't fall for any petty. Don't fall for pettiness right now. Yeah, Leo energy, Ace of Cups in reverse, strength, pull back on your emotions. That's your true strength. I could keep pulling cards, but this is pretty much what it's saying. Do not let this person or these people trigger you into acting out of character. Do not feel like you have the right to act out of character or pop off or act a fool because you're not getting what you want right now. This situation didn't turn out the way you want it right now. Now is not the time to do that. So let's um, draw some channel messages. Give me a thumbs up if this has resonated so far. Hidden information. Didn't I just say that? The truth is coming out. Pay attention to signs and symbols. Like I said, cancer, you don't have to do anything. This is your full moon. You're not supposed to be reacting and responding. You're supposed to sit back. Be in your feminine energy. Fellas, if you're a cancer watching this, that doesn't mean, you know, being a woman. It means being in your feminine energy. And that means letting things unfold naturally, letting things manifest. You don't have to physically do anything. Let things manifest for you. And then we have they've already told you once. So I feel like I'm not the first person to tell you to sit down and not do anything, to be quiet. Some of you have been, you've, you've had some type of like dream that told you, that showed you what was, what was to come. Listen to that, listen to your intuition. Yeah, they are lying to you. You don't have to react and respond. It will be revealed. I mean, it's pretty much saying the same thing, Cancer. So this is good. Be patient. Let things be revealed to you. Okay? That's your reading. 
I hope it was helpful. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. I'll see you on the next one.